So for this site here at the Caddo Mounds facility on this native prairie, the point of the project is to restore the native ecosystem to the, the open prairie setting that, that probably would have been in some of these sites in East Texas that were more open, that were more upland. Our goal here is to go in with either one year fire return interval, so to burn it every year, or even sometimes to wait, lay off a year and burn it every two years. We're standing in the middle of the, what I call the Temple Mound field, uh, and it's approximately a 40 to 50 acre plot uh, that we have put back into prairie grasses and flowers. Uh, for a number of the projects that we were wanting to do here, uh, it's important to get our grounds back into more natural grasses and to get fire back onto the property. Turkey played a very important cultural part of Caddo life. Their very first social dance is called the turkey dance. So we have wanted turkey uh, here for a while. I knew that burns would be a very important part of getting them back here. I then met Alan Shadow with the USDA and at that point we started to talk about returning prairie grasses to this field. Fire is very important to the management of these prairies and forested grasslands typically that we had within East Texas. And we can see here uh, one of the bunch grasses, blue stem, has burned. We see the burned out center. This was a couple weeks ago and we're seeing the regrowth. This is another one of the clumps of blue stem where you can see the black center underneath. And this is just the amount of regrowth that's occurred within the last couple weeks. The fire is what keeps these systems functioning. These grasses evolve with fire. They're more vigorous under fire. There's a return of nutrients back to the ground with fire. The fire also eliminates the undesirable woody species that would come in and overtake these areas. The fire is what keeps these areas open. It's what maintains the prairie and keeps it in the grass system. Uh, these are bunch grasses. They're important to the wildlife. Uh, the Bermuda grass and Bahia grasses that are introduced are turf. They don't allow for bare ground to be uh, in the system for game birds and songbirds and things to utilize to forage on the ground. The bunch grasses grow in these clumps like this and have bare ground between the stools that allow these animals to utilize the ground for forage and travel where they're impeded with the turf grasses that are, we see in some of the introduced pastures around here. When Tony contacted us about this prairie restoration, uh, we really jumped at the chance to be involved. It's a great opportunity for Texas a Forest Service to work with our other partners like the U.S. Forest Service that sent us an engine for this burn, the Plant Materials Center from USDA and their work on these different plant varieties. That interagency coordination is key both to our success on these individual prescribed burns and as a training component for all of those organizations going forward.